Hello friends, today we will learn how to draw scatter plot by using R programming. So first of all, we need to know what is scatter plot. So scatter plot shows many points plotted in the Cartesian plane. Each point represents the values of two variables. One variable is chosen in the horizontal axis and another in the vertical axis. This simple scatter plot is created by using plot function in R programming. So for this let's open R Studio. So this is R Studio and I am using the version R 4.1.0. So the basic syntax for creating the scatter plot in R is I need to use plot function. Okay. After that, I need to give the value of x ordinates. After that, I need to give the value of y ordinates. After that, I need to give the title of this figure by using main. Okay. Next. I need to give the label of x axis and label of y axis limit of x axis x axis that is going to be used in the plotting x limb and y limb okay whether the axis need to be written or drawn on the plot or not for that I need to use another parameter axis so this is the uh, this is the basic syntax of uh, plot function okay in our programming so here x is the data set whose value are in x ordinates and y is the data set whose values are the vertical ordinates main this main is the title of this graph okay next x lab it is the label of horizontal axis y lab this is the label of vertical axis label in the vertical axis x limb that is the limit of the values of x used in the plotting and y limb that is the limits of values of y used for plotting and this axis indicates whether both axes should be drawn on the plot now we will draw one scatter plot by using one uh, inbuilt data frame available in R programming so let's say my input data sorry my input data equal to I am going to use one key stored data frame in our programming that is empty cars. okay so in this database I am going to use two column okay so for that I have used the function and the column name is wt this is one column and another column is M T G okay and uh, this two column data is uh, used to store in input data data frame okay so this is my data frame new data frame the name is input underscore data and in this data frame the data of uh, WT and MPG is going to be stored here okay if you are interested to know what this uh, data frame looks like you can copy here and paste here let's execute so this is the data of this data frame okay so this is the different type of uh, motor vehicles name okay and this is the parameter okay and I am uh, using this column mpg and this column 
for drawing the scatter plot okay so in uh, so this is my input data okay now i am going to uh, use this data let's so here let's define all the parameter so x is equal to input data frame underscore w t let's execute this one then it automatically appear here y is equal to input underscore dollar symbol mpg okay let's give the title of this figure or this scatter plot as weight versus weight versus mileage weight versus mileage x level will be weight y level will be mileage mileage let's define limit of uh, x axis is 2.5 to 5 ok and limit of y axis is 15 to 30 ok and y axis both are we can uh, omit this one okay as we are not going to use so this is my code to draw the scatter plot so i have selected all this all this code now going to execute by clicking the run button you can see this is my scatter plot okay weight versus mileage so this is my title of this this is my title of this scatter plot so this is the this is the level of y axis this is my level of x axis and here you can see i have used x limit between 2.5 to 5 so my x axis starts from 2.5 and ends at 5 and this is the limit of y axis now i am interested to save this figure okay to save this figure that is weight versus mileage uh, in png format I need to write here PNG function. Okay, so within this PNG function, I need to give the file name. So let's say my file name is file name is scatterplot dot png. Okay. Dot of so let's execute this code once again okay so you can see my code is successfully executed okay now we'll see uh, this figure is already saved in my current working directory okay uh, for my case current working directory is document folder so let's go to document folder so you can see one uh, png file is created here that is scatter plot so let's open this one so you can see uh, my plot is successfully saved so this is the procedure uh, to plot scatter plot in our programming thank you for watching